Hi guys, since T3000 and today is uh, layout plans. Now, um, before I do any wall -E reviews, I just want to get this video out of the way. Um, I've done all the plans now and um, it should be taking action in January. And I've, you've probably seen the video, I've brought all the stuff for it so far and I've worked, it's worked out to be enough for it. So all the track and everything for the moment. There will be loads of stuff I need to get for it, but yeah. Um, but as you know, um, when I went there, I did forget to mention, um, fact I had a great day with uh, Dan, Cross Country 170, and um, Hornby and BF3 fan, um, Will, he's, a, he's really nice, so yeah, thanks for a great day guys. And also, I did purchase a, a case for my mobile phone, uh, British Rails Black, um, which is pretty cool, um, I do like this case, um, so yeah, just you know, just for that. But anyway, basically on the video. Okay. This is this is quite it's not that thick, um not too bad. Basically is logo, S and D, model railway plans plans, project, ideas. Uh station they right, there is one about the station. I uh, it's based in the Midlands, right it's up the road from me, basically I live in the village and it has a station. Um but it's um in the Midlands but um it's going to be based in Somerset and Dorset line. Um, so, yeah, uh, before you, you, you're going to see all these pictures of it, um, and uh, you're probably thinking that's not Somerset and Dorset, but you know, I will make it look like a kind of Somerset and Dorset uh, station. But the initial plan um, of the SD, um, it's going to be based uh, something three by two meters, two meters and three, um, but here. It's a station, basically two line station. And then we come round and it's like um it's quite open and hills and then it's like uh, what I have in my exhibition layout where it goes on the ridge. And then you come in and then you got these in, like enclosed hill sort of thing. Um like the hills go into where the track is, like the track's in a dip, and then you got like a manor house and a town and a church. It goes on the corner, there's your yard. Um don't know if I'm gonna put the uh, freight like yard there. I have a um, like not used line. I'll just store rolling stock on it, and it comes back to the station. So you know, it's it's quite interesting now. Um, so yeah, here comes the history part of what I'm doing. Now the initial uh, plan is mainly the station, and at much detail as possible. So here is uh, Grimes Hill and Whiffle Holt um, back in nineteen nineteen thirties or twenties. Um, it's called modernised now. But it was a great western sort of station, uh, where I live anyway. Um, so I live that way, uh, basically. Um, about two minutes away. Um, but as you can see, uh, no bridge or anything. There's a platform, and had a ramp over a road bridge, and then you come down the other side and you go Stratford, and then Birmingham, that way. So, um, yeah. Um, but yeah, you can see, it is quite a nice station. Um, it's quite, it's not that big. Um, but, you know. Um, so I did a little bit more research, and I went on to uh, like you know, Google some maps, and um, I went I zoomed in, and it gave me 3D, and uh, it actually made it 3D. So this is the station now. So you got the waiting room, and then you've got another waiting room here, and then the station, the booking office is up here, moved up here now. But you got a nice ramp coming down. You got ramps on two sides, and long platform, and there should be a signal up here. But I have. I have ordered a DAPO motorised signal, I can't wait, it's, I think it's an LMS uh, home signal, but that be around there, and it's just, it's, 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 yeah, that's it, and then, so now you've seen it in present, and, yeah, so this is, I, I did loads of research, it's quite hard to find these pictures, but, um, yeah, I found this one as well, and now you can actually see people on this as well, so, you know, it gives you pants, but you see the Great Western lamp posts and stuff. But as you can see, there's an, there's a ramp in the old booking office. There's a road. Um, but I love these ramps coming down the side of the bridge, and then it has look it has like an enclosed uh, like ditch there. So and it's on a slight curve, but I'm gonna make it a bit straight. But you know, you can add loads of detail, like all these. Uh, I can make all of them fencing and like all the bridge and everything. Um, but it'd be S and D, obviously, like a Somerset and Dorset. Uh, kind of station, and then I went on to find this image, and it looks like a uh, some sort of Pereri tank, um, 
come into the station, but you know it, it is is the station is like in a ditch, so you can see uh, that, and I think that's a pretty nice image. And they look like people going to war or evacuees. So you know it's this is like the 40s sort of thing, um, but you know it you know it's been modernised, but it looks pretty cool as a station itself. And then I found went to the found this image, and this was nineteen in the nineteen yeah nineteen sixties, and um, this is where it sort of started to uh, you know modernise a bit. You got the old uh, station still, and then you got the shelter there. But you know it's starting to lose the Great Western effect. You can see all the signs being taken down now. Um, so yeah, and you got that nice curve. You can see it right into the distance on that kind of rolling hill on the ridge there, you can probably see and it comes here and there's like the hill banks each side and it's going to fall apart now I think so yeah, the station, now you've seen on the images, you probably understand this right, the bridge is there and then you got the, the path going down and then there's the uh, station now there is a pico, I like the big pico this brick with the green um, like station with the shelter and then you got all that and then that's just overgrown hill and stuff now for this overground stuff um, basically I typed in um, I saw the other day I was looking at hanging baskets and I saw the um, like it's hanging basket uh, cover sort of stuff so um, I uh, looked at that and I thought that looked like overgrown so I typed in, and of course, model railways popped up straight away, and it had it used it and it looked pretty nice. So I'm going to order loads of that, but you know you can see it all there. Um, but yeah, you got a shelter that side, two lines, um, platform two and platform one, and it comes all right down there. So yeah, there's the plan of the station. Uh, now I started doing some three D uh, drawings um, of the station. There's the signal. There's a the platform. It's not that these are quite cheesy sort of pictures. So that, I think that's a station done with. Now, this is the most basic picture ever. Uh, so you've got the station up there and it comes on this ridge going around the corner. And you probably understand that. Um, yeah. And it's like, it's, like, it's like a paper slideshow. And then, and then on one, it's straight on the other side of the of the layout, it's just going to be hills enclosing, and there's the two lines, and there's a little shelter, and bushes and trees, and, aha, this is the, like, incoming, like, enclosing hills again, with the yard, uh, the three lane yard, and the, that should be two line, that track, sorry about that, <laughs> did three lines by accident, but yeah, and, uh, yeah, that seems to be it. So yeah, um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, oh, sorry, no. What am I doing? Right now, to get the, the platform kits I got from Wally as well. Um, I built those, and I got two massive ones. Uh, I mean, not not too long. I mean, if you imagine a normal size radiator, it's sort of that long on the radiator. So yeah, got two of those, but mostly it's be well, I'm imagining the bridge will be here. The bridge is going to be there. The ramps are going to come down the side. Probably end here. Not too long. Or here, even here. I might, you know. And then here, there's station building. I don't the same for that side. And up, what that way is the uh, signal and the uh, hill. I mean, like the uh, on the ridge, and then that's in the closing hills there. So uh, yeah. Thanks for watching guys, uh, please subscribe and comment.